Hey Pisces, and welcome to your reading. I hope you guys are blessed and well. Let's see what's going on with y'all beautiful people, okay? Something is going to end abruptly. Just understand that it's for your own good, okay? For the sake of goodness. You're a very honest, caring person, and you grow honestly. Um, like, you're the type of person, like, you have, like, authentic viewers and things like that. Like, people authentically are viewing you. People authentically like something that you're doing. You could, at this time, feel like something is failing, but it's truly not. It's just something that's changing around you. It could be friends. It could be anything, truly. There's some kind of fear here also that I'm picking up, but you have to have courage to keep going forward. Because you're going to be successful, even though you've been denied. Just give up something. Just, like, give up, surrender, accept the fact that something is not going to be anymore. Because whatever this is that you're doing, you're providing a service to other people. Yeah, it's balance. Something is being balanced out, whether you like it or not. I heard relax, like just relax, release. And make sure that you are giving to yourself. I feel like the main thing you hear is your growth, being honest with yourself and actually making those changes. Changes that are necessary. Hmm, Pisces, you got a lot of people that do not like you. It's a lot of people that talk about you when you're not in the room. I feel like somebody is trying to see which way you're going. You could be indecisive, but it's like somebody else is like they're anticipating on that move. But you're being guided. There's some kind of guidance here that you may have been seeking, but you have the guidance within you. So if you go within, you'll see exactly what to do. Yeah, this is a lot of money coming towards you, Pisces. A lot of it. You could have heavy earth placement, specifically Virgo. You could be a Virgo North Node or Rising. Or you could even be a Virgo Moon. But Virgo is highly aspected in your chart. There's a warning here for you to release something, okay? If you don't release whatever this is, it's going to go away anyway. Like, something is going to end. I don't feel like you're going to be torn up about it, but it's going to kind of suck. Your digarush is going to suck <laughs> because, you know, you're used to whatever this is. But something is not, like, beneficial to you. It's like you're benefiting people. But these people are not beneficial to you or whatever this environment is. Somebody does things without thinking of you as well. Like if you're in a relationship, like this person will make life altering dang on decisions without telling you or consulting you. Without asking how you feel about something. Somebody has taken some kind of action to do something when you should be in a caring connection with them. I'm also too picking up that you're healing a connection, but there is some envy here. You could have walked away in the past. I want you to remember why you walked away from the beginning. Like, remember why you even walked away from this person or this place or whatever this is. Like, you have a contract. Something is being told. Like, somebody is telling something. I feel like you're getting impatient with somebody. It's a masculine energy. You're getting impatient with them in their strategies. Like somebody just keeps on trying to defeat you. And you're not able to be beat or something. I feel like you're really tired of this person. Like they keep on challenging you. You know, they don't have to do this at all. The doors have been closed in someone's face. Like they could be viewing you. Like you're taking advantage of a situation, but the situation is just there to work for you. What I said. The situation is supposed to work like this. It's supposed to work for you, not against you. Like the system is supposed to bring justice to you. You're supposed to get justice. 
You're supposed to, like, everything that's happening is supposed to happen just like that. I feel like it's something about you not having to do anything. All you have to do is just grow. All you have to do is make the necessary changes, and you're going to accelerate. If there was any stuck energy, all you have to do is, like, be still. Like, you, you get power in being still. Like, your power comes from you being still, like, letting God handle a situation. Like, you have automatic karma. Like, you, the skills will always balance in your favor anyway. It's just inevitable for something to work out for you, Pisces. Someone rising north, no. Yeah, you, you got a lot of people that are up against you, but it doesn't even matter because it's like they're not going to win. Even if someone tries to, like, attack your money, whatever, I don't know. It seems like somebody been in this energy trying to tamper with your money, trying to make you lose money. They're specifically focused on your money. So you can have Capricorn in your chart somewhere as well. I was getting this same energy from Capricorn. Do whatever it is you want to do. Like you have like a burst of energy. You may not want, um, not want, but you may not know what to do with this energy. You dig a root skew, do whatever you want to do. Like, um, put time into your business. Whatever this is, it's going to elevate you anyway. Like, there's nothing but growth. You're doing nothing but growing, and it's a whole lot of balance here. I feel like somebody is jealous of your growth. They're jealous of the fact that you can balance something and they can't. Well, I mean, that's not your problem. I feel like just always tell yourself the truth. Like, always, you know, analyze the situation for what it is. Look within yourself first. It could also be some kind of family, um, like a curse that you broke off your bloodline. And you're getting taken over. Like, I'm feeling anxious all of a sudden. It's because, like, it's that time. Like, ready, set, go. Are you ready? Are you even ready for something? Like, something is about to be handed to you? Yeah. And it seems like it's from another person. It seems like this person... Whoever this person coming in to you, like, they got a lot of experience with different things like traveling the world being around different kinds of people here queen i don't know but it's like whatever this is, is going to work for you and it's going to last for a very long time it seems like something is going to come out of nowhere like you're not going to get notified about something you're not going to have any notification about it there's also like a courthouse situation that's going to resolve itself. Like you're obviously going to be a part of it, but it's going to end up getting resolved unexpectedly. Like you literally don't have to do anything. And it's like once you try to start doing stuff, that's when you like drop in ranking or something. Especially like when it comes to uh, doing work and things like that. Anytime you try to put your hands on something to retaliate against someone, you drop in ranking. Your journey gets cut short or something. And you have to like redeem yourself. Just keep your slate clean with the father I feel. My dad is watching everything you're doing. He's definitely watching you. It seems like something with a housing situation is coming to an end as well. Yeah, I'm picking up heavy, heavy anxiety for you. It's like you're learning your body or you need to learn your body. You need to learn the difference between you, you being alerted with your intuition and something actually going on. I feel like most of the time when your anxiety is going off, it's like alerting you that someone is in your energy. It's not necessarily that something is happening because your anxiety is really bad. Like you could feel like something is about to literally happen to you. There's nothing happening. I feel like somebody has been doing that to you. It's like somebody is so used to being able to manipulate and control you using anxiety as a tactic. Like attacking you. You could have some kind of trauma and somebody has been playing on that and you don't know that they just literally sit around sending energy to you here, Pisces. <laughs> like you have no idea. That's all this person does is sit around sending energy to you and then they watch you to see how it's affecting you. So this could be spiritually spying. They could be spying on you with like tarot. They, 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 this is like a person that does like, you know how teachers have like a, a, a behavior chart. This person does that. It's like they go and check on your behavior. They use tarot to check on your emotion and your behavior. Like you're a child or something. So this could be your mother. 
but they they do something very often it's like um they may disapprove of whatever you do but it's like they're a whole hypocrite they're sitting in the background participating in the same thing for a lot of you you're gonna find out that you were truly adopted or something somebody is mad because you can switch up just like that like you can definitely get right to it right then and there because you're professional somebody didn't think that you were capable of being professional yeah you're about to get a message about a house or something like that or you may not get the message you might be able to just purchase a home this is not leasing this is ownership somebody has royally messed up like they they messed up uh coming for you especially if they were like thriving off of like anxiety i'm i don't know why i'm like all of a sudden getting extremely anxious in this energy pisces so you could have like sporadic anxiety attacks it's not real like something is not real and then you, it just goes away or you're going to learn how to control it or something. You're going to learn a surefire method to control whatever this anxiety is. Somebody has been doing this to you, and I mean for years. You could have even went through the dang on emergency room because of this. Like you thought something was happening to you and it's not nothing happening. You are going to live for a very long time. Um... So you could like be thinking of death. Like you could be feeling like you're about to pass away. You're not going anywhere. You dig a roost you? And I mean that, you're not. <laughs> I don't know who you may be specifically, but you got a long, long life to live here. Yeah, you could have had like a near death experience. Like you dodged death. You're sitting in a very comfortable energy and somebody doesn't like that. So they're trying to make you uncomfortable by attacking you spiritually they do this very often Pisces so don't be shocked you're going to learn that this is only spiritual attacks like once you recognize that something is not happening like the more somebody keeps doing this to you the more you'll be able to get through it yeah this person is set on making you miss out on something like just say if you um, have a job uh, interview coming up this person and they know about it they may not know specifically that you have a job interview but they may know something is going on because like i said they check on your energy very often here queen they send a freaking non-stop anxiety attack to you for you to start panicking and then ultimately you're too busy trying to calm down that you will completely miss the job interview that's what somebody has been doing that's how they have been blocking you with yourself. Like they've been using you against you. All because they're jealous. This is somebody who feels like they have not accomplished much in life. So the only way that they can catch up is to slow you down. But catch up to what? It's like they're trying to bring you down to nothing. So basically this person is just now getting started in life. This is more than a late bloomer that you're dealing with. You could be in your late 20s, early 30s, and you got someone that's in their 60s, 70s competing with you. This person feels like they have no money saved up. They feel like emotionally unavailable. They feel like nobody gives to them. This person could feel taken advantage of some kind of way, but I don't feel like it's by you. I feel like they just take everything out on you. You definitely block this person. You block them and now they're upset with you because they were mentally tampering with you. And it's like, well, why would I stay around? Like you, you're not gonna sit up here and stay around somebody who is literally like attacking your mind every single day. They're doing this and they're doing it with evil eye and everything else. You're purchasing a piece of jewelry, and this jewelry, you're going to feel like it's a lifesaver. I feel like nobody has ever had this jewelry. It may look worn, but it's not ever been worn. And it's like all of a sudden you got this forward movement or something. God is definitely protecting you. 
follow all the instructions. Like God is giving you instructions. Make sure you follow the instructions. Yeah. Because somebody is doing work on you every day. And most of this is regarding a relationship. They want you to be pretty much left out. With no offers, just basically working, slaving, and getting nothing for it either. So not only is this person trying to ruin you spiritually, they're, they're, they're attacking everything. This person does not want you to have a relationship with God. They don't want you to have a relationship with other people, with yourself. They don't want you to have like a public following. Like this could even be a whole group of people, but I feel like it's one person specifically. Or if it is multiple people, like they all have the same goal. Like to mess up your work, basically. Somebody is definitely tampering with every single part of your life. Every area of your life is under attack. Yeah, but you're still going to end up getting exactly what you want. With no illusions. Like God does not create illusions. If it's a blessing, it's a blessing. If it's a test, then it's that. For, yeah, this is... Some, somebody is going to be so heartbroken when they find out they cannot control you. They're not going to be able to sleep. Somebody is not able to sleep now, I feel. I feel like they feel like something is coming, but they just don't know what. But it's after they've done so much to you. And now they're finally getting caught. Somebody is finally getting caught up for what they did to other people. But it's like now you are in the mix too. So it's like you're added on to the list of people that they have to pay karma for. Like they didn't have to get in this situation, but now they're in it. And it's like nothing nobody can do. They can't get out of this. Somebody has definitely been sending the energy of death to you. There's nothing happening to you though. You are completely dodging many bullets. Like these are fatal bullets. Like fatal shots someone is taking at you. And it's all truly because you're a great person. Somebody is just very jealous of you. Okay, Pisces. Remember that God loves you inside the way.